So last year I did my first ultra marathon. It was uh, the 50K down at the Surf Coast Century um, for 2021. And that, that was, it was a lot of fun. It was 28 weeks of training. It was uh, 1200 kilometers plus, actually more than 1200 kilometers plus in distance and volume in training over the 28 weeks. And I did about 17,800 meters of elevation as well. And there was, there was lots of stuff in that. There was lots of lessons, lots of learnings, and it was a lot of fun. So you're probably thinking, that's great. Or you're probably thinking, why would you do this? And it really just comes down to, I love the challenge, I love the progress, and I love documenting that progress journey. And, you know, as I've continued to progress <laughs> in my running over the last eight years, it becomes a bit of a, an addictive challenge in terms of always wanting to grow, always wanting to learn. Now, I could have thought about doing the next biggest and better thing, but I actually wanted to come back and just enjoy the process again, have some fun and just see what I can do. It's not about setting necessarily a bigger and better goal, but actually just setting the goal of doing it again and seeing what I can do and starting with a different intent in mind in terms of trying to overcome that progress of overcoming that challenge of training over a long period of time and making sure that I can show up fit as a fiddle and, and get it done, right? So when do I start? Well, very, very soon, right? The race isn't till 17th of September. Just kind of brushing out a few things, a few little obstacles that I'm dealing with at the moment to actually commit. Excited to be able to do it again. And I'm gonna start documenting that journey. And I have a couple of questions for you. Is one, what do you wanna see in this documentation? I like to just hear from you if there is certain things that you would love to see. Some things I love documenting, some things I hate documenting, but I do wanna make sure that this series is as fun and enjoyable as possible for you that's watching and coming along for the journey and the other two questions that I have is do you have any running goals of your own this year and the third question is if you're not a runner do you have any big ambitious goals or challenges that you have for this year I would love to know let me know in the comments below share with me because one thing that I love to do is document and share progress of goals whether it is with my reselling whether it's with my podcast whether it's with my running and that's what I'm all about right so if you've got something that you're doing I'm curious to know I would love to know please let me know <laughs> And if you're doing this race as well, the, the Surf Coast Century 50K, I would love to hear from you as well. Regardless, continue the conversation down below. I would love to know. Whatever you're doing, whether it's going for this 50K, whether you're doing something that's completely not running related, uh, you got this, right? And it's all about setting the intent and actually then taking action and making it happen. So wishing you all the best and more details on this to come soon. Let's do it.